थोड़ा सा थोड़ा सा फरमाइए थोड़ा सा अपना दीजिएगा थोड़ा सा अपना जिगर का एक टुकड़ा को संभल के संभल के इस तरफ अपना नजरिया नजरिया का एक एक कण इसमें डालिएगा ये तो एक बहाना है प्यार का शिल सिला तो पुरा ना है यही तो एक बहाना है प्यार का सिलसिला अपने गुप्तगु अपनी छोटी सी मुलाकात निरंतर चलता रहे हुजूर आला हुजूर आली सबसे तो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू ट्राई टू ब्रिंग इन टू अटेंशन योर अटेंशन माई अटेंशन समथिंग अबाउट द सुपर नेचुरल इन ए वे और मेटाफिजिकल और द सटल पार्ट ऑफ द बॉडी द बॉडी हैज गॉट इन आवर रिलीजियन और इन आवर हिंदुत्व और इन आवर सनातन इन आवर वेद एंड पुराण देर इज वन फिजिकल बॉडी दैट वी डू एवरी डे वी डू आवर टास्क स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम नित्य कर्म त्याग कर मूत्रमल को बिहान दे सो दैट इज नित्य कर्म हम कर दैट इज वन फिजिकल बॉडी और वन पार्ट ऑफ द बॉडी और अदर पार्ट ऑफ द बॉडी इज वेरी मिस्टिक वेरी हिस्टोरिक एंड वेरी यू नो यू माइट से डिफिकल्ट टू डिफिकल्ट टू पिन पॉइंट इट इज वेरी सटल अनलेस वी ट्राई टू एक्सप्लोर दीज थिंग्स I I am going to start from two areas. The first one is called tantra or tantric. The tantric form of practicing different things. Also, puja to the god. Tantric form of puja was practiced by Indrajit or Meghnath. We captured Indra and brought him to Lanka. He practiced this tantric form. All right. So that is one. Now this one is related to tantric sex. tantric sex is very slow meditative form of sex meditative form of sex the end goal is not orgasm but enjoying the sexual journey and sensation of the body it aims to move sexual energy throughout the body for healing remember this it aims to move the sexual energy throughout the body for healing transformation and enlightenment all right so that is one aspect then let's go to the other area which is very closely related they are kind of you know interrelated highly so this what is the other area the other area is the form of you know the chakras or the wheels in our body the wheels in our body according to the hindu scripture the vedas and puranas many many scholars have try to explain it let me try to simplify it so there are seven of these chakras which are arranged according to our spinal column starting from below the first one is called the muladhara chakra or the root chakra next one is called the swadhisthana chakra which is related to the sexual organs then there is the manipura chakra which is behind the navel then there is anahata chakra which is related to heart and there is vishuddha chakra which is in the throat there is agnya or kamand chakra it is between the eyebrows and finally the sahasradhara chakra which is in the crown now these are the seven chakras in the buddhist or in the tibetan buddhism they have recognized four of these and there are many other writings and you can always check you can always give opinion or you can condemn if you think it is wrong but whatever i have tried to put together is you know use mass of related things which is impossible to be read in a short notice okay and the third one the first one i told about i read about i explained about the tantric sexual activity this one is about the chakra the third one is about what is called the nadis 
or the pathways through which our breath or our you know breathing or the movement of air throughout our body occurs and there are three form of nadis one is called the ida nadi the bisuddhi nadi and sum sunimna nadi name does not matter here so this nadis and this chakras are all integrated it is very closely they are interrelated they are integrated and they are in in consonance with the other one cannot practice without doing this of course there is yoga also patanjali created the yoga shastra and this tantric form of yoga is slightly different as it is said of course it is to take a respiration deep respiration by making pakam pakam inside your the cavities of the lungs the trachea the bronchi and the alveoli by expanding the chest pakam is created throughout and the air automatically will go into them we try to forcefully forcefully put the air or you know inhale the air and expand them as much as possible that is also a form of yoga of course there are postures there are you know hand movements finger movements body movements abdominal movements body wall movements yoga is also there and then there is in this one there is a third one the third one is called the yoginis or the kundalini kundalinis are yoginis i am explaining to you about the tantric way of you know doing sex and also tantric way of controlling your body in in close relation with the chakras in close relation with your respiration which is also part of yoga shastra as explaining as explained by uh, by explained by the guru of yoga in our traditional texts now let's come to this one tantra rudramala tantra there are several yoginis yoginis are female form of teachers as, as i said kundalini muladhara chakra i already told you about the basic chakra muladhara chakra is associated with a yogini called dakini pradishtana chakra where the sexual activity is related or it is controlling the sexual activity the yogini is called the rakini manipura chakra is related to lakini she is also another yogini then anas anahata chakra is is related to kakini or is a form of kakini is another yogini then bisuddhi chakra is sakini then there is agnya chakra hakini but there is no uh, you know yogini which is related to the sahasra dhara chakra which is in our crown of our body so this is a bit you know longish may be complicated if you don't like it fine but if i have made some mistakes try to correct or condemned and i'll come back to you if you like to practice the second part first part is i explained to you about the chakras i explained to you about the tantric form of practicing your daily life including the sex third one i explained to you about whatever is possible why i could gather about the you know all the yoginis so let's keep that aside for a moment if you like to practice i'll come to the second part hold on if you like to see ye to ek bahana hai ye to silsila to purana hai mere bhai aur behno 